Why, yes, there is a reason I'm not wearing a shirt. All right, so I'm not wearing a shirt because I threw it off. Same as my hat. I felt something crawling on the back of my neck, so immediately I reached up. Boom, hat came off. Ah, ah, still feel like there's stuff. Yeah. Hat came off. Boom, and I, I felt something crawling on the back of my head, basically. And the hat came off. I'm like, okay, maybe it fell on the back of my shirt. So I took my shirt off. And bah. So what am I doing? I'm making gumbo. Look. There's onion and peppers and celeries and peppers and meats and shrimps. And now we're getting ready to do the roux. So it's been eight years since I've attempted to make gumbo. Here goes. All right, we're cooking. It's about close to 2.30 right now and I'm working on the roux. The roux, my dad says, it's the most important part. You screw up the roux, you screw up the whole thing. So. It's going to be imperative for me for about the next 30 minutes to keep an eye on this thing and make sure it doesn't burn. The idea is to uh, keep mixing this uh, mixture of flour and oil until it turns about a peanut butter color. So hopefully about 30 to 45 minutes or so working on this alone and then I'll start adding ingredients. With any luck this place will start smelling like his house. Yummy! Okay, my roux is really coming along I would say. Oh, probably about another 15 minutes, hopefully. So uh, it's on a pretty low heat at the moment. I just don't want to burn it. And Dad always said that if I did burn it, I would know it. So hopefully, hopefully it's good. Well, it's coming along. Just a matter of time. So. This smells really good. I think it has a bit of promise. So I think I may have actually done it for once. So hopefully, hopefully. I've only made this two or three times. And all three, every time I have though, it was six years ago and it came out too flowery or this or that or whatever. And I just, I could never get the same flavor as my dad or my grandpa Keith. This time it's, for one, it's a lot darker than what it normally is, no doubt about that. But, whew, come on, come on. Just once, just once, come on. All right, there it is, gumbo. Will it be as good as my dad's or Grandpa Keith's? Probably not Grandpa Keith's. As good as my dad, probably not even as good as my dad's. I don't know, we'll find out. I think the expression on my face says it all. Okay. So I was really disappointed by this at first. Um, the main issue actually ended up being it is really, really under seasoned. I seasoned the veggies. I seasoned everything before it went into the pot, but it just wasn't enough. So more salt, lots of salt, and uh, and 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 some Tonys really did the trick. And I have a feeling that tomorrow it's going to be even better when it really mellows out. So I I, I, I should have given it a fair chance because it's actually turning out not to be half bad. So I will say that. So not as good as my dad's because it is still a little bit oily, but it's not bad. Check it out, vlog exported. I'm aware it doesn't really mean anything whatsoever. Eh. 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 I'm still four days behind. Well, three technically, because today's doesn't count yet, because it's not over yet. So, that's not bad, right? I'm justification. You can hear that rain out there, do you hear it? Come on now. Listen. Just say Very peaceful. All right, I wouldn't normally go to bed this early. It's not even 11, on, let alone on Sunday night. But um, I have to wake up early tomorrow. I have a dentist appointment to finish my root canal. Yeah, I think I'm just going to get a cap. I have no idea what's happening tomorrow, honestly. I have no idea. So are they going to do another one? Or am I just going to get my cap and be out of there? I have no idea. So I'm going to do that. And uh, we're hanging out with Catherine tomorrow. Should be fun. We're going to have tacos. Yeah, she said we're having tacos because it's Cinco de Mayo. Bull crap. You don't need an excuse. You always have tacos. <laughs> um, tacos. 
I think we're going to do Chex Mix. I don't know yet. I know we talked about it. And uh, probably going to watch Thor. Maybe the Avengers. No idea. But it'll be fun. So I'm going to go to bed though. And uh, ooh, I'll upload a vlog tomorrow morning. Try to get a vlog edited as well before I go to the dentist. And then when I get back from the dentist, I will uh, get it uploaded. I th well, that's my plan anyway. So, you know. Things don't always go according to plan, but hey, that's okay. Life is unpredictable. How do you like that? So, I will see you tomorrow morning for another day. Hopefully it's not raining, but I don't mind. It's very peaceful. I like sleeping with my window open when it's raining. You just listen to it. Ah. Good night.